Hail my brethren and welcome back. The dream of a unified Europe is nearly here. We are working on Denmark. And at some point we're going to try and take through these areas, I'm sure. But first, we have to deal with the Spanish. This is my major concern at the moment. We have armies in place. They are ready to attack. So I think the thing to do is just to activate all of these buttons. Not you though. These other four. Let's actually move you... Uh, Which army is which? You're, you're over on that side now. So it goes you, you, you and you. Okay, I like that. So they're all told to go forward. So uh, let's just commence. There's nothing really to worry about. They've got all the aerial dominance. No, they haven't. We're actually being fought back here with planes. Well, that's a, uh, a new thing. That is very new because I had some sort of crazy idea about flattening this area now that we have the uh, device to do so you know maybe we, maybe we would we'll just ace pilot from good for him can he uh, maybe come over here ah did I forget about the most important thing I think I might have I think I might have as far as strategic bomber again I forget about that so often so, uh, yeah, we can't actually drop anything anytime soon because I don't have any strategic... Po yeah, I do. I have these. But we're not building any, are we? No, we're not. So we're going to put you in here. And any extra factories that come by, I want you working on these. 15 should do the trick for now. George, you're ill. Italy again wants to join us, but I don't want Italy to join us. I want Italy to... Well, join us in a different sense of the word. We are really struggling over here. We really are. It'd be a shame if someone was to uh, drop a huge missile on their heads. Yeah, the Spanish are really uh, shredding us over here. They've killed 600,000 of our men. We've killed more of theirs, obviously, because we are Germany, but. Huh. Why are you struggling? You should not be struggling. You should have this entire coast guarded. This is unforgivable. And London, how are you doing on your old planes and ships? Eh, I reckon we'll destroy them eventually. Denmark is uh, is on its way down. So we can be very happy about that. The British weren't able to get anyone over here to uh, look after them. The Egyptians made the mistake of thinking that they could help. And they've been punished for it. So now this army is going to continue to go all the way to Copenhagen. Hagen, Hagen, whoever they are. They will be destroyed. Just occupied, liberated. I should use the correct terms here. Alright, better marines will come in useful later on. And then we have a uh, strategic bomber. Let's learn about a better one of them. Yes, we shall. How are we doing over here then? 75? Do we have a strategic bomber in the area? Soon. Soon we shall. We are actually pushing forth a little bit here. And we're liberating. Of course we are. Yes, we are liberating Franco. Of course. Oh, I never forgot about you, Franco. I just needed to be reminded. I never forget about my dear friend Franco, never. How could I, how could I forget? I wouldn't, that's the point. Let's not have them landing on our area, please. We must defend these coasts. Right, Copenhagen is uh, struggling to be taken. Could you guys, like, uh, all go over here? After this, you can just garrison, I guess. Denmark has completed it. Excellent. Well, your army isn't needed at the moment, so just go ahead and occupy all this land, would ya? Then we'll tell Mr. Blue Boy to, uh... I guess he can just stay where the hell he is. Good stuff. We got some more Russians? Alright, we got six more Russians. Well, we're going to stick you all, despite even there is a tank division, we're still going to stick you over here. We don't need Russians for now. Yeah, the 
French are over here now. But we still have that all well looked after and we're pushing in pretty well. Just got to wait until we can drop the message properly on these Spanish that they are to be defeated. Iceland takes control of foreign affairs. Good, good for them. They're, they're making the right decision here. And we are struggling. I could move over more planes at a second's notice, but I want these guys to win. They're struggling. They really are. Whose planes are we even fighting? Probably just the British and the French and everyone else. But I'm sure we have better production than they do. Struggling on tanks. Plenty of guns. No sense of war, fighters. We have nearly a thousand extra fighters. Okay, well, which... It's you guys who are going in. So we're going to give you some more planes here. Try and find an airfield. 400, I guess, is something. Actually, let's scrap that. Let's do two of... 200, 200, and 200, and we're going to get you guys, actually we should have just put them all onto him, well there you go, they'll uh, do their job for you when they're ready, I'm getting offered lots of troops from my foreign allies, but there's, there's no need, oh excellent, well it's time, Spain, Say goodbye to Madrid, and where else? Sevilla, perhaps? Granada? Let's go for Granada. Let's take out Sevilla and Granada, and let's see how they feel about war after that. 26 towards capitulation, yeah, yeah, yeah. Atomic bombing of Granada. You're going to ignore Madrid. For the first time and hopefully last time in history, a nuclear bomb has been detonated in Granada as part of international warfare. The unprecedented, unprecedented destruction stands as a testament to the devastating power of this new weapon, which is feared not only for what it can do to its targets, but for what implications it has for those who deploy it and for humanity itself. The world holds its breath waiting for what will come next. Will the force... Will this force the Republic in Spain to surrender to avoid further terror, or will it only strengthen their resolve? Well, we're about to find out. Apparently, it didn't do anything, so that was kind of pointless. Oh, jeez, look at all these armies coming in. All these Japanese, all these... Who are all these people? Afghanistan, Persians, Turks... Everybody's here. Finland, Bulgaria... Yeah, it's only a matter of time and these Spanish will be done. Done. Spanish. Gone. Then we can have a nice peace treaty here. We'll have our Spanish friends liberated. France will be liberated. It'll all be liberated. That's definitely the word we're looking for. And of course, lands will be returned to their rightful leadership. Rulership, whatever the word is. Alright, Spain, we're gonna we're gonna use you as an example for the British. Hey Britain, you ever heard of the uh, city of Toledo? Yeah, well uh That's gonna be you one day, Britain, if you don't get the heck out of this war. The United States is uh, holding on well there, but they don't seem to be doing anything to advance their position. Bomb was still going off. But yeah, Spain is pretty, uh, it's just a waiting game for Spain. Who dares wins, of course. Then we'll have plenty of armies ready to, uh, be reorganized. I'll do that off camera. I'll reorganize all the armies off camera and get ready for an invasion of Britain. And we'll, uh, come back when the time is ready for such a thing. Hopefully we can keep, uh, hammering down their navy a bit. Didn't get anyone there. But the navy does seem to be getting smaller. Uh, how? We, we don't seem to be getting anyone. Losing a fair few planes. I hope they are too. Losing planes, Britain? Not even sure. I can't tell. Can't tell what's going on. But we can get some better tanks and artillery. 
I, uh, I don't mind that. I don't mind that at all. Let's also learn more about this. Production. I would like some better panzers, please. Leopards will do. And some better artillery. Thank you very much. And some better... What is this? Close air support. Alright. Well, we should have had them a long time ago. Okay. As for guns, I think... Yeah, we have plenty of them now, so I could cut back on these. But it's still nice to have the MPs going. See, the British are already trying it. That's what I was concerned about. So needs to hurry up here and get all this occupied before they uh, can do much about it. They're not even half. They're barely halfway. The British are going to be here soon. Right, what armies do we have spare? So you occupy here. You occupy here. And... Uh, you occupy there. Your army. All these other areas are already occupied, so we could get you and your units to swing around here a bit. 26. Yeah, we'll do that. But you guys do actually hold there, so we don't need you to be... Not you. We don't need... Who the fuck is it? I need all these. I need to have a serious reorganization, but we don't need you guys there. Serious reorganization will be had in between episodes. Get everyone, everyone where they need to be. These armies aren't going to struggle much longer. If you even call that struggling. We've got a few more. Rush. Okay, never mind. So, peace in our time. Don't know what all that is. But uh, we will be taking this land personally because it is it is uh, rightful German land. There's no doubt about it. So we'll take that straight up. And we'll see what else we want. We could take the, uh, the Nord area, Picardy. This is a great Germany. Right, Spain is what it is. We could give them... Uh, Pyrenees, but they weren't exactly useful during the war, were they? So there's no real reason to give them anything. There's all these areas as well. Okay, Turkey. What is the Persians as well? No, this was all the Turks. But the Persians haven't had anything. We can't just give them, like, most Mosul, can we? Have the Turks come around. Let's see what Turkey looks like when we give them... Uh, this region and this region and this region and that region and that region. Didn't I have all the coast? Let's give them that. And Kuwait. And that. Okay, Turk. Let's see what you look like there. No, they definitely need it. They can't not have Mosul. That's quite a big Turkish empire there. In fact, let's give the Turkish uh, Mecca as well. We don't need that. We are Germany. But Germany will have a sort of uh, nation here. The question is, which one do we want to puppet in the region to make? Yemen, Oman, Abu Dhabi, Qatar. Yemen fought the hardest, so maybe we could give them a little area here to uh, be our vassal state. Yeah, let's have a look. Yemen, I'm going to puppet you. I'm going to give the Yemeni their own little German Arabia down here. Very good. That is just what it is. I don't know what I can do there. Alright, there is the Belgian Congo, but these sort of areas, it's not really of our concern, really. Ideally, I would have had South Africa take everything along here and Egypt take everything to the north, but I can't do that. There's no real nations to puppet there for now, so we'll just ignore it. There is the uh, Indonesia, which we could give to something. That is also Vietnam. There's a lot of places around here. So we, we paid you back. Pay basically all these people back. There's still France, however. What can we do with you, France? We could liberate all of these African kingdoms. We don't need them. 
satellites. Where would we want to satellite? Cayenne, Tunisia, Algeria, the Kingdom of Morocco. No. Um. I guess we could satellite Morocco. No, we'll give some of this to uh, Spain. That's what we can do here. Spain, you can have Morocco. In fact, you can have this entire mouth here. We don't need that. But then there is all of this Africa. There is a lot of it. We care more for Europe. There is here. We, we, we are Germany. We do deserve some colonies. So we will take Madagascar and the islands around it. We deserve to be a colonial power. We can take, uh, take these regions as well. Germany deserves. Excellent. We are the great power here, so uh, we'll take what we can of our rightful land. Excellent. Okay. So there is still the question of Africa. Maybe we could leave France with it. Maybe. Spanish, let's give you that. A little bit extra. Okay. Well, Belgium, all you have is your African colonies. So what we'll do is we will... We could just liberate them. And then give them to South Africa later. I think that's what I'll do. Liberate, liberate, liberate. What do you mean I can't? Alright, liberate. Liberate Burundi. Very good. And as the Netherlands, you have the Dutch East Indies. will not be doing such a thing. We'll ha be having the German East Indies. Republic of Suriname. No. Suriname is here along with this. So we could satellite Suriname and give them the other one. French Guyana. We'll do that. Very good. There are also these other Caribbean islands. I don't mind taking that personally. Excellent. That just leaves the French Commune, who I think I will just simply uh, puppet. Puppet them there. Is there anywhere else I would take Normandy? No. no. I don't think there is. I think we'll leave that as France. And we'll, uh, we'll finish up there. Excellent. But now we do have a few armies with things to do. Just your four. Because we do have the garrison force coming along here. And it's still the south coast, but I think we have this mouth pretty much closed off. I don't think we have to worry there. The British don't have any of Africa. France could use some guns. We're going to send them some guns. Start a land lease. We're going to give them uh, 20,000 of these. There you go, France. You can have that. And in Spain, they could also use some weaponry. So we're going to send them the land lease. They can have, uh, you know, some of these. Again, 20,000 will do. Very good. Get our allies up to scratch. Not the Russians, though. Okay. Well, <laughs> Spanish Civil War is over. It took till 1945. What I'm going to do here is I'm going to reorganize all of my armies. We're going to have an army ready to take on Italy and an army ready to take on the British. And uh, I'll see you guys then. Thank you for watching. I hope you are enjoying the content. I am enjoying giving it to you. I'll see you guys next time. Thank you again for watching. Goodbye.